Hi, this is Jim from Rigid. We're here today to take a look at our utility locating. We have the SR20 and the SR60 locators. First, we're gonna take a look at the SR20. It has a collapsible mast, omnidirectional antennas, a total of eight antennas total. Now, the additional antennas are for line locating, which are actually gonna give us a direction to our target line that we're trying to find underground. Offers a nice screen size, runs on 4C batteries. This will actually excel at SON locating to find remote transmitters and SONs that are built into cameras. Where this locator sets itself apart is it's a utility locator. It will find buried metallic pipe. It'll find buried metallic cables. Anything that'll supply a frequency. Now we're gonna take a look at SON locating on the screen of the SR20. So as we power the unit on, we verify the frequency. 512 with the sound icon lets us know we're trying to trace the sea snake camera head. I have my frequency on my locator set to 512 hertz, which is the frequency output of the camera head. Once I'm set to 512, I'm gonna use the proximity signal. The higher the number, the closer I am to my target. We have a real-time depth reading in the lower left corner. We also have our proximity number in the upper left corner. Now again, the higher the number is, the closer we are getting to our source. So as we move closer to the camera head and that number increases, we're gonna notice the pole. When we zero in on the pole, we get the direction. Now the pole is not our camera source, that is the edge of our signal. As we get all the way to the highest reading possible, we see what we call the equator line. The equator line is going to run perpendicular to the direction of the pipe and we also have a real-time depth reading. As you can see, I am now seven inches from my bottom antenna to the source of the camera head. So it's very simple. The higher the number, I'm getting warmer. The lower the number, I'm getting colder. So as I use that number to get to my camera head, the information displayed on the screen will pinpoint the location and give me real-time depth and also give me direction of the camera and the pipe underground. Now the SR20 has a range of 10 hertz to 35,000 kilohertz. The SR60, which is our flagship locator, again has the collapsible mast, eight omnidirectional antenna, offers a larger screen size. Key features to the SR60 over the SR20, the range of the frequency is 10 hertz to 490,000 kilohertz and also offers simultrace. Simultrace allows you to trace two separate frequencies simultaneously. That is our SR60 locator.